Top five reasons people are moving to Sandy Springs. On this episode, we are talking about the growing cities in and around the Atlanta metro area. Let's get into it. You're probably wondering, where is Sandy Springs in the heart of Atlanta? It is north of 285 and west of 400 in the northern part of Fulton County. And here's some fact about Sandy Springs. The population is in and around 106 thousand people it got a score of eight plus on niche.com and it was ranked 18th best city to live in america had a median home price of four hundred ninety thousand dollars number one parks and recreation there were over 950 acres within the city limits of sandy springs with 16 separate parks little tidbit all the parks open from 7 a.m to dusk every day local favorite morgan falls overlook park is an awesome place and there's even a really cool spot where you can rent canoes kayaks and paddle boards that is sponsored by high country outfitters so if you want to get out on the river float on the chattahoochee that's a great spot we also have the Chattahoochee River National Recreational Areas. And if you're following our channel or you don't know, we are actually doing a specific series on all 17 parks in and around the greater metro Atlanta area. Within the city of Sandy Springs, you have over 22 miles of Chattahoochee River and three of those parks are right there. You got Towers Island, East Palisade, and Island Board. So these areas offer some awesome opportunities. So you're probably wondering, okay, there's a lot of parks, but what do you do there? So there's hiking, picnicking, walk by the river, fishing, just a bunch of different things that you can do outside with you and your homies or your family. Check it out. Number two, community and family centered. Sandy Springs hosts some really cool, fun and engaging festivals throughout the year and has some awesome opportunities to be in and around the community and to have fun with your family. And these festivals include the Sandy Springs Lantern Parade, which which highlight the Chattahoochee River. City Green Live, which features local and well-known musicians throughout the summer. Sandy Springs has one of the most fantastic fireworks show in the greater Atlanta metro area. You're not gonna wanna miss that. Food That Rocks is an awesome event. Big tents filled with all kinds of your local favorite food vendors. It's great for the whole family. So those of you that don't know, I am married with two young kids. I've got a kindergartner and a toddler. So we're always looking for fun, free things to go to festivals just like this. Number three, business opportunity. Georgia is home to the highest concentration of Fortune 500 companies. Sandy Springs has the highest within the city limits for the state. A total of seven Fortune 500 companies gives you some great opportunity right in your backyard. Sandy Springs has a 3.2% unemployment rate. The national average is 6%. Sandy Springs saw a 2.9% in job growth, then projected over the next 10 years, 45% above the national average of 33% percent nationally. Both the average income and the median house income is a lot higher than the national average. What does this all mean for number three in business? Well, that gives you a lot more opportunity for work, stability, and a great place to network. Number four, the City Springs. This mixed-use development property has so much to offer. Restaurants and retail, including the General Muir, the Sandy Springs Farmer Market, and Nam Kitchen. The Performing Arts Center, which is made up of two main theaters, the Bears in the studio theater. City Green, which is a four acre park, which is a great spot for festivals, concerts, and just a great stroll of families and friends. Number five, proximity to downtown Atlanta. You are 16 miles away and 15 minute commute. So if you are a commuter working in and around the downtown area, this is a great spot. Those who prefer public transportation, you're in luck. The city of Sandy Springs is one of the few places that's outside the perimeter that MARTA, the public transportation, in Metro Atlanta, Georgia, actually has access to. So back in the day, I lived in Sandy Springs for a short stint. I used to jump on the North Springs train, go south, go to Lenox Mall, go to Midtown, go downtown. Then if I ever had to travel and get on an airplane, I would love to hop on MARTA and ride all the way to the airport. Thank you for tuning in on today's episode. I hope this was helpful for you. And if I missed something, let me know in the comments below. My name is Greg Go with Goat Home Partners at Real Broker, Northwest Atlanta's favorite realtor. Like, subscribe, catch y'all next time.